everyone and welcome back to Battles Live. My name is Erica and if you haven't joined us before, um, this will be a little segment um, just giving us a short tutorial about um, our app called Battles. It's an animation app that lets you um, draw anything and everything that you can think of and then animate it. Um, instead of going frame by frame, it's more just um, you can animate the things that you draw and the different layers. So it makes it a lot easier for beginners or anyone to um, animate. So um, today on our poll, we asked if you prefer it was hat and mittens or boots and snow pants. And it was pretty much 50-50. So I made a dial relating to one of those. Um, and if you have any questions while we're going through, um, Kelly's on camera and can try to answer those for you. Otherwise, you can always shoot us a DM if after you download the app, you have any questions. Um, in order to download the app, it is not on the app store yet, but it is um, in beta testing. So if you go to our Instagram page and click on the link in the bio, it'll bring you to a page and you have to answer five questions. Um, and within 48 hours, you'll get an email um, giving you beta access so you can start trying it out for yourself. And the beta testers did get a new um, build, which now has the photo import, which we will be doing a tutorial on that later in the week. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. So this is what I have so far. Um, um, it's just a hat and one mitten. Um, so one of the features that we do have, if you click on the mitten, um, and click these three dots down here in the bottom, it's going to bring you to this page, which, um, has, um, a lot of different options. Um, and the copy button will give you a second one. And if you hit this flip button, this is going to flip vertically. So it's like the other hand um, and layer that on top. And then this is like the okay button up here, this green stack. So you click that, um, that'll go away. Now, if I wanted to group the two mittens together, um, what I would do is first peel back the hat. So that's going to be this left um, corner piece over here. So that just goes away so that I don't group the hat with the mittens. And I'm just going to drag from the left, and this same um, bar is gonna come up, and I'm gonna hit group, which then makes this all one layer, um, and I'll bring the hat back. Um, but if I wanted to um, animate that, um, I can hit this drill, and that's gonna make these two different items again. So if I wanted to rotate each of them a little bit, and then change the rotation point. It's automatically gonna put it in the center of the item, but I want it to rotate from up here in this corner and then click the okay stack a couple times and then do it again to the other one. And do the same with the rotation point up here in the corner and then press play here. So then, because these are grouped together, I can also animate this as a whole. So if I just wanna make it scale up and down, it'll bring up this slide bar, and the higher you go, the bigger it gets, and then if you bring it down, it'll make it smaller. So just have them sort of pulse. don't like the way that that looks. So if I wanted to get rid of the scaling, all I have to do is, um, I can either recreate it, which is right here, or I can scroll down and hit the trash button. Um, so if I wanted the hat to appear, all I'd have to do is hit those three dots again, and this is gonna be the visibility option. And I bring that all the way down to zero, and click okay, and then, the animation here and just do visibility 
bring that all the way up so it appears and then flash a little. So those are just a couple options when you're animating. Um, our other options are uh, moving, uh, rotating, we know one over, scaling, and then the visibility. Those are what we have right now. And if you ever have any suggestions on what you wish that Dottles would have, um, shoot us a DM and we can talk to our team about it. We have a lot of new features that are up and coming. So make sure that you um, keep up to date with um, the updates that come out and um, give us any feedback you have. Um, but um, if you have any questions while you are going through it, if you click these three lines over here, it's the menu bar, and these short tutorials will help you with anything that we don't go over or isn't explained well enough. Um, and if you click on them, it's gonna open up um, a YouTube video, which will just be like a minute or two long. Um, and these videos are also on our YouTube channel, which is just dod.les. And you can subscribe and see any tutorials we're posting on there. Um, but if I wanted to export this, all I'd have to do is click this little airplane down here in the corner. And it'll give you the option to export either as a video or a GIF. And you press share. Um, it'll know render for about 30 seconds. Um, and it'll give you a ton of options to send it out so you can share it with anyone. Um, so if you want to send it directly to a person or if you want to save it. Um, so here you can either save it, um, I can airdrop it, um, all these different options here. So that's how you do that. Um, but yeah. Are there any questions so far? Um, anything else, guys? But if you guys start creating your own dottles, um, be sure to post them on Instagram with the hashtag doddle, and we will find them and put them up on our Instagram story. We would love to see the stuff that you guys are creating and share it with our followers. Um, and if you want to follow our other accounts, we do have a Twitter and the YouTube page that I was talking about before. And we do have a Facebook community. And um, we, what was I saying? Facebook community. So um, there you can post your dials on there. Um, or you can post any other art that you have and communicate with artists who are already in the community. So it's a super cool place to be a part of. Um, be sure to check our Instagram tomorrow. Um, we'll have another poll up probably. And... That way you can decide what kind of dotle I make for the tutorial tomorrow. And anything else? Okay, well, we'll see you then. Bye, guys.